Exodus chapter 8 is a story. So, where God had spoken to Moses. And he told Moses, he told Moses, to go to the Pharaoh. So Pharaoh and to command Pharaoh to let his people go. So Pharaoh And Pharaoh tried to compromise with him. So Pharaoh to how many know Satan many times tries to get you to compromise? We don't compromise with the devil. You see how the enemy tries to deceive us. The first thing he tries to do is convince you that you can stay where you are and serve God. But this is not true. God called the Israelites to leave Egypt. And he calls us to leave the old life. And come into the new life. But many Christians. They don't want to leave their sin. And they try to bring it with them into the new life. They try to serve God in Egypt. And it doesn't work. And we have to understand that you cannot serve the Lord and live in the old life. 2 Corinthians chapter 6. We must leave the old behind and come into the new. I know many of you may be struggling in an area. God wants to break you free tonight. Because there are many Christians. They come to church. But they have not changed their thinking. They have not left broken their habits. And so they miss out on the fullness of God. Because, see, Satan doesn't mind you coming to church. As long as you live like he wants you to live. See, there's a lot of people they leave their Christianity in these chairs. They go to church. They shout. They cry. They pray. They'll even give in the offering. But then they'll go home. And they'll leave all of it here. And if you see them at work, they're not acting like Christians. If you see them with their friends, they're not behaving like Christ followers. And that is a problem. 
Because that's what Satan wants. He wants you to be a Sunday Christian. He doesn't want you to take him home with you. God has given you some great pastors. God has given you great leadership. Because he wants what is here to spread. Amen. But you cannot compromise. You let God change your hearts. Let God transform you. Allow the Spirit of God to destroy your old life. So Become new creatures in Christ. So 